You have never truly found Jesus if you do not tell others about him, said Charles Spurgeon. An evangelism explosion study found Christians express a desire to talk to others about their faith, yet very few have shared with someone how to become a Christian in the past six months. Here's a young man sharing what he could not contain in his heart about the gospel on Logan Paul's podcast. As I've grown, I've came to obviously the faith of Christianity and my belief uh, in Jesus Christ, that he died for our sins, and that's what I hold true to myself. Now, as I got older, of course, you ask yourself so many questions, especially about my type of mind, I ask questions in anything. So... As I went through that whole process, uh, I really got revelation and I've been honored to be blessed to be in the presence of God at time. It's almost like this. When you're when you search and you continue to search, you know, and you get enlightened in moments, you want to scream it out to everybody. Notice that the young man is sharing something that he experienced and tasted for himself. This cannot be duplicated. Jesus said, for out of the abundance of the heart the mouth speaks. We can only give what's within us and, here is a man who has tasted that living water. And you want to tell everybody of what you discovered. It's like, if you want to talk about stoicism, there's a part, uh, I think it was uh, Socrates, somebody, somebody that was studying stoicism back in the Greek times. There's a uh, situation he put people in a cave, right? Or Allegory of the cave. A cave, right? And then all they seen was the shadows and that's all the reality they knew. Mm. And then one guy escaped it. And then he was able to see the light and where the shadows were coming from. And he discovered the truth um, outside of that cave. Then he went back and tried to tell those people, yo, there's this out there. And they looked at him like a madman. Kind of same way of the things I discovered with my faith mm. and the things that I've been enlightened with and the presence that I've felt before and the peace I felt and the focus he's given me and the wisdom that he's displayed onto me. I want to tell people. D.T. Niles, a Sri Lankan pastor said, Christianity is one beggar telling another beggar where he found the bread. That is true of every sinner saved by grace through the proclamation of the gospel by another Christian. But true understanding comes from within. So unless you're willing to search for it and with, uh, trying hard just like you do in everything else, you'll, you'll never find it. There is a time period called grace given to all humanity to seek him while he may be found. The prophet Isaiah writes, seek the Lord while he may be found, call on him while he is near. The same time period of grace for repentance is also the call to the church to reach out to the lost.